uh, all of that information was just as shocking to us as all of this. Oh has yeah, been do you believe you. that? I'm still not sure that they didn't know. I mean, it's just it's, it's hard to imagine. They were at the point of making out in public. Like I don't know. I feel. I would say. And obviously, I don't know shit. I'm, this is just based off of instinct. But I would say they probably were unaware of the relationship with the employee. But I would hazard to guess they were aware that Ned was not, not a good guy. Right. That's possible. They are probably sick of his ass. Yeah. And the reason I say that is because after this news broke, there was a bunch, because they, they, um, their whole thing started on BuzzFeed, I guess, yeah. uh, like 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. And a lot of uh, women who worked at BuzzFeed were tweeting things like, this is the least surprising news wow, I have okay. ever seen in my life. So this guy is just a big old dude. I think so. I think so. Huh. I so yeah, again, I don't think that they knew, I don't think they knew he was having a relationship with an employee, but... I think he probably behind the scenes had a rep as being a horn dog. I think you're right. I think as business owners and as they seem like decent guys, if they knew that he was having an affair with an employee, that's so unethical and possibly illegal. I don't know. Well, it just opens them up to lawsuits. Yeah. The, yeah. The, the, the woman, like it was consensual in this case, but you know, if she wanted to claim that she was coerced by her boss to have a sexual relationship with him, that's, that's a huge deal. So, yeah. Um, also, I failed to mention that his wife is part of the whole production and they're all friends with his wife, too. Yeah. And he's got kids. Oh, fucking loser.